Today I'm going to answer a question and that is how do you add page numbers in Canva? Now my name is Paul Miles and I do videos on how to make it, keep it and grow it. That's your money I'm talking about. If you like videos like that, hit the subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell and give it a thumbs up if you like it. So I've got a question, how to add numbers to pages in Canva? Well, it's actually not that simple. But I had a look and tried to come up with a way which I think is the quickest. So go over to Canva, click on create a design. Then you click on custom dimensions, change from pixels to inches, and then put in your page size, which will work on eight by 11 today. And we'll have our blank page. So what you'll need to do is click on text, just click on subheading, double click, and put in the letter or the number one. Then we're just going to turn that into a rectangular box and we're going to make it a little bit smaller. And then what you need to do is drag it down to one corner of the page, like so. Then click on the copy or duplicate button, which is at the top, and then just move that across to the same side, to the same position on the opposite side. With page numbers, obviously you've got page number in one corner and then it's on the opposite corner on the opposite page. So we just need to duplicate, copy page and just go through the number of pages you want. Canva only seems to allow you to do a maximum of 100 pages. So if you want 120, you need to do 20 and then 100 and then merge them together. If you want to know how to do that, I did a video on creating a simple KDP um, low content book or no content book and that's linked above. Okay, and then we go back to the beginning and it's a case of doing this. Delete one number, scroll down. In the opposite corner, change that to the next number. Delete the other one work down, change that, delete the other. Approximately 10 hours later, we get to the last page. Now, if you do know a quick way of doing that, I'd be grateful, but I did search around the internet and couldn't find anything to, to show you how it would be quicker. So that's the only way, I'm afraid. Why would you create a number page? Well, there's many reasons, but some people will do this if they're creating a sketchbook interior because KDP don't like it if you just upload blank pages. So you need to put something on each page so you could have, in effect, a blank page with a number in the corner, creates your sketchbook interior, which you then just download like so. It's a PDF print, boom, and then you just upload that to KDP. That's it for all for now. Thank you very much for watching. Remember, hit the subscribe button, smash the notification bell. Until next time, goodbye.